So, welcome back to a new storyline of Black Ops 2. Let's go! Safety's on, dipshit. Hey, old man. Was Raul Menendez here today? Sergeant Woods. Raul Menendez is the leader of Cortes Dia. And the most dangerous terrorist since Osama bin Laden. <laughs> Fucking waste of time. Guy's a vegetable. Back off! All he said was, mi hermana. That Spanish for sister dipshit. You boys better get your shit together. He's gonna attack. If you have information about a threat to national security, you gotta tell us. Turn the camera on. Your old man. He's doing okay in Alaska. Fucking Hudson showed up. Dad, I'm scared. I, I need help. You're seven years old, David. Stop acting like a baby. David, wait! Go back to the army, like you did when Mom died. Lieutenant Colonel North, NSC. You already know Jason Hudson. What are you doing here? Yesterday, Sergeant Woods led a covert team to take on an arms smuggling ring in Angola. This morning, we lost contact. So go get him, CIA. Why are you here? Castro and the Russians are all over Angola. We can't go in. The CIA have buried the mission. Woods and his squad no longer exist. We got whatever you need, Mason. Name it. David can stay with Jenny, like before. She loves having him. He'll be fine. Dad, you said you'd never go back to the army. You promised me. It's Uncle Woods, son. He'd do it for me. They found where I was being held prisoner with a spy satellite. One of them KH-9s. This baby, it shits out of film canners for 12 miles up. And the C-130 comes by and snags it at about 30,000 feet. This was not the digital age. This film had to be processed, analyzed, and delivered all by hand. Our dog in the fight. This guy named Jonas Savimbi. <laughs> you think I'm fucking nuts? <laughs> this guy. <laughs> no! I need help over here! Hold on! Mason! Savimbi, you gotta help! <laughs> Hell yeah. Information, you copy? Go ahead, Hudson. Okay, Hudson is in the helicopter right now. He's right there. 
Oh, here we go. Here they come! Here they come, my brothers! Fight, my brothers! Bombs are Bombs are charged. Don't walk in front of me, okay? Oh, access. I need that. Face him! Target the motor cruise! Nice, the mortars. I can just like bang it to the side of this truck or something or with my hand. World of War be like. Come, my friend. They are weak. We must finish them. <laughs> There's so many guys on screen, though. Sound in this game. That's true. Victory has begun. Death to the MPLA! This is a real war callback for sure. The helicopter comes back around. Wait, he was alone on that thing? Where's what? The MBLA is not yet defeated. That's a very dangerous rescue, my friend. Where is he? He's being held captive by a Nicaraguan gunrunner. A very 
very dangerous man. Where? About two miles north. He's on a transport barge on the Tupango River. He may already be dead. Let's go, Hudson. Okay, so now we're going to save wood. Hopefully that will be something. Even though I know how it goes, because I obviously uh, played this campaign before. I was in my A and now. But your old man thought I was dead. After all that shit Kravchenko did to him. The numbers, Reznov, he's stuck in his head. He had no idea it was real. How the fuck could he? Kravchenko. When I sliced that bastard open, he saved everyone's ass. When he comes through first, boom. Welcome to the Hanoi Hilton. Six months later, they shipped me over to Da Nang. And this fucking place made the Hilton look good. Plus 17 of my group. By 72, it was just me. I was not gonna die in a fucking swamp. So that's how Woods made it out. On the At the end now. of uh, his mission, where he took down Kravchenko. The barge matches Finby's intel! Woods should be inside! Bring us alongside, Hudson! Sarah's taking fire! Oh yes, we are taking fire. That's for sure. We're going down! Jeez! <laughs> he wasn't ready. Clear the decks. His face looked awful. Shit, we got gunboats right on our tail! They ain't gonna let us go without a fight! Jeez! This does something. They're still coming. Holy shit, I don't even have motion girl on, but this is just weird. Still left, or I mean right, because this is the actual right side. Ah yeah, the boat went through. Those guys were going on. Okay, Mason, we're clear. Open up the container. Give me a hand with this, Mason. <laughs> yes, I will come. God. Woods, are you in there, brother? Bodies are badly decomposed. These men have been dead for weeks. Woods. You could already see him in the back. Frank? Frank! It's me. 
It's me, Mason. What did they do to him, Hudson? Jesus. Get Woods to cover! Come on, Woods! That arm's great as a gold mine! Grab the TGM! Wow, was that too far? We've probably attracted the attention of every MPLA foot soldier in the area. We need to move. You would think. Oh, what is Hudson? Uh, smart guy. He's really smart. Come on, Woods, I've got you. I got you, brother. <laughs> Ahead. The antenna means they've got a radio. It can cost of MB for emergency extraction. Who would be using that? Hold! Take cover behind that lock. Here we go. <sighs> what the hell are Cubans doing here? <laughs> Just kids. Okay, so they found uh the helicopter, I think. Otherwise, that wouldn't have gone off, right? Stay low. Keep your head down. Don't move. Let the pass. Child soldiers. Okay, on my lead, we run for the wooden hut. Shit! They've spotted us, Mason. Aqui, 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 aqui. Did I really? Don't move, let the pass. Okay, on my lead, we run for the wooden hut. Now! I can't really run, but okay. He has a grenade launcher on his AK. Stay close. So we are three stealthy boys. <laughs> Woods' his head is in his ass. Hold position, they're right in front of us. 
Okay, we're clear. Move out of the grass. We can walk now. You'll be okay, Frank. I'm gonna radio for help. I'll take care of Woods. Watch yourself up there. Try not to draw any more attention. Beer trap. Here we go. Mullah Rahman. Do not concern yourself with local politics. Prosta Marianietka. Kakti. Dead. Kakskazano. You are a dead man unless you do exactly as I say. Tune the radio to. He fucking punched it a little bit. No one move or this fucking gets it! El americano le está diciendo que no se mueva. Shut up! Él piensa que está en control, pero él no es. I say shut up! Lower your weapon! I swear to God, I'll kill this bastard! Los americanos no saben nada sobre la lealtad. Quizás nosotros deberíamos demostrar. You son of a bitch! Oh! Hudson, we're moving! Get to the beach! Did you secure an evac? Negative, we're on our own! Head for the river! Gavin Mason! Sounds like half the village is on our ass! What the fuck happened back there? Can it, Hudson! Just keep moving! No, it's not. What the fuck happened back there? Can it, Hudson! Just keep moving! They're closing in on us! We gotta buy some time! Okay, that was what I was trying to do, but it just went off. Use the puncture platform to snipe! Get up high! Provide cover fire! Why is it not working? Okay. We gotta get moving, Hudson! Throw smoke! The fall is not even automatic. Okay, so this has to work. funny Keep moving. because Woods still weighs like at least 70 kilos <laughs> so about 100 pounds 120 I'll deal with it. Get Woods in cover. okay so that happens of course I don't see shit. I 
I don't see anything up there, but I get hit more. How is there suddenly a boat here? We were just here. Come on, Frank. Come on, we're getting out. No. Fucking Russians. Damn it. No way out. Crazy man. Well, we got him, Mason. Can't kill me. But Hudson still got shot. Okay. <laughs> you can't kill me. Thanks to your old man. Put it on the line for me. For honor. For friendship. Yeah. It's just like you, kid. No man left behind. Name. David Mason. Solarium, Myanmar, 2025. So now we're going to the future. That's how it started. Her old man tries to kill Menendez. Menendez wants payback, even if it takes decades. Menendez, back then, was a, uh, a big fish in a small pond. He made his cake on the drug cartel out of Nicaragua. There's a hand-me-down. Mm -hmm. The CIA smoked his old man. Old Cyclops is pretty pissed at America. While we're fucking around in the Middle East, the Russians and the Chinese are getting real cozy. Huh. Now, the politicians, they want you to think this is about ideology. It's a lot of horse shit. Give me your phone. Go ahead. Rare Earth Elements. Whole fucking world runs on this shit. <laughs> Who controls all of it? China. So while corporate America is kissing China's ass... Now the mysterious Cordes Diaz social network has crowdsourced simultaneous protests in both Iran and North Korea. Never seen in public, who really is the leader of Cordes Diaz? He's known only as Odysseus. Odysseus? My ass. <laughs> Raul fucking Menendez. Asshole. I told JSOC, but they were too busy. See, the drone race had started. I mean, really, guys? You're gonna build an entire military based on a mineral element that's wholly controlled by China? I need a drink. Dipshit. No, oh, God. Give me a soda. Get it from the nurse's stash. None of that diet crap. China's premier Chen is outraged by Cortez Diaz's leaked memo, alleging the cyber attack was covertly ordered by the White House. And through all the dirty shit the U.S. government's gotten away with, this time, they're innocent, and no one fucking believes them. They take out Cortez Diaz's network. Two days later, the director of the FBI burned alive. Right now, a billion people believe that Raul Menendez is their savior. Shh. Guess what, boys? He's not. You better take him out pretty fucking quick. That shit's gonna happen. And then has got a whole private fucking army hidden out there. Cubans. They lead rank. State-of-the-art tech. How many followers does Cortez Diaz have right now? What, a billion people? Try two billion. You'll never believe their leader's a terrorist. They think Menendez is their savior. They've got a hell of a disappointment coming. They just That's don't know it's say. Menendez. Time to go see what Menendez has got hidden down there. Ready, Harper. Keep momentum on your swing. Don't want to be left hand. Oh. 
Oh, you have to swing. Totally forgot that. The surface is a little uneven. Jam hard with the nano gloves. So far, so good. Ready? Okay, hot shot, your turn. Here we go. One more time. Let's go. We got him. Why didn't cross me all? Jeez. His followers sure did. And what does Cortis Dia mean exactly? It's left. Heart dead or some shit like that. Sounds like something noble. That's what Menendez wants his followers to believe. Trust me, it isn't. Crosby, you're up. Okay, so he follows, or he leads. Alright, let's go, bitch. Oh, the steering is also stuck to me and the other guys. Think of that. Let me move on my kill. An EMP grenade will fry their cloaking systems. Oh shit, he was close. That came down. I'm gonna use the elevator. Nice. 
nice. Okay. That thing is uh, done. Now we're going back to the courtyard. Nice headshot. Even though it wasn't a hit. underground cracking this is section surface installation is neutralized moving to investigate secondary structure let's blow it stand back ah oh, there was a delay to the third Watch one step floodwaters may have weakened the structure Ah, the same biometric scanner, though. Holy shit! Look at this! What we saw up top was just a front. Walls are several meters thick. We lose comms inside. Update Briggs. Tell him we're moving in. Kragan, this is Harper. Confirming SciTech installation beneath the temple. Requesting immediate cleanup and containment unit to our location. Be advised, we will lose comms as soon as we make our entry. Kraken confirms. Ground team moving for immediate insertion. Stand by. We're going to hack this box. We need it. Flag fest. Oh no, it's optical camouflage. Salazar, get it open. Enemy's optic systems. We need to get our techs working on analysis. Maybe you should shoot up. They'll barely see you. No, no. no I don't think so. They got an ASG. It's Scott's too tight. Scott up. Clear the area. Jeez, it's flashed. Harper, hello. Upstairs, go! Keep pushing! They sure as hell don't want us in here! It's all automated and shit. Why are all the lab decks actually dead? It's their lab, right? So we made it to the elevator. Target the nitrogen tank. 
thinking, Salazar? That shit was up real good. Oh, use it. EMP. That's the job, right? Oh wow. Okay, we're clear. We're gonna we're gonna access this box. We want uh, an ASD or AGR as it was called. This is 3D fabrication tech. Weapons, components, armor. Menendez is arming himself for war. Woods told us how much wealth Menendez built over the years. He's been investing in weapons tech. Somebody's here. It's this box. Please don't hurt me. Okay. No one no. out. This lab what is linked to a known terrorist. Yeah. Don't just don't. <laughs> My name is the song lyrics are coming I'm back. A magnetometrist. Yeah? And what is uh, Menendez's interest in you, buddy? They brought me here to process the solarium. It's a new, rare earth element that will render all existing microchip technologies obsolete. They're coming. Get me out of here alive. I'll give you everything. Down! Okay, that's where Solarium is. Shield! The Follow music me. is kicking in. Watch out, Eric. Quantum entanglement. This single device has more processing power than your entire military infrastructure. Rumors around the lab were that Menendez plans to use it as a basis for a massive cyber attack. I, I heard talk of something called karma. 
It may be the, the name for the cyber weapon. If Menendez uses a solarium worm to initiate an attack, there will be nothing anyone can do to stop it. I couldn't stop it. Oh! Even though I know that's coming, I still don't expect it at the moment. Harper, get a sit rep on the support team. Behind us, we got incoming. Crack it. Harper requests for confirmation on extraction team ZTA. Defensive positions. Crack it, come in. No dancing, no response. We'll fight our way out, with or without support. This ain't over yet. Get some help. Sentry, your team can stand out. It's Briggs. Stand out. It's the extraction team. Why would team. he be here? Boy, are you a sight for some eyes? I guess we can call this mission accomplished. Admiral Briggs, good to see you. You too, Sentry. Whatever Menendez is planning, Solarium is the key to it. Just a man, Admiral. He'd like you to think he's something more, but he ain't nothing but a sad old pitiful excuse of a man. A bit like Boots. Now we're going to Old Wounds. I can't figure out Menendez without getting inside his fucking head. Salazar, you grew up in Nicaragua during his rise to power. You know his legends better than anyone. Tell me, why does he hate us so much? Tu primera guerra fría. As a boy, he witnessed the country's rape and murder his people. In 1972, there was a colossal earthquake. His family lost everything. A year later, the only thing he ever loved, his sister Josefina, was crippled in a fire. Raul and his father started over, sold drugs for easy money. They became rich, powerful legends of Managua. The Menendez cartel was all but untouchable, so the CIA took a Raul's father in a U.S. sanctioned assassination. Right, so now Menendez fucking hated America and started running guns in Afghanistan for his own private army. CIA got wind of it, went on the hunt for him in Kabul. That was the photo Wood showed us in the vault, remember? See that handsome bastard? That's me. The only one's your father. After Nam. The numbers and all that? I mean, he was one dangerous son of a bitch. It's showtime, Mason! What'd you see, Woods? Sand. Sand and more fucking sand. Hudson's contact's on his way. You reckon we can trust the Chinese? We can't hear. They've been supporting the Mujahideen, same as us. You know, if Russia was in Afghanistan, they'd be looking at China next. No one likes the Russians, huh? You know me, I don't like anyone. You might want to get your head down. They're fucking red. Take it easy, Sal. Deliver the weapons. Now, what about your end of the deal? I will take you to the leader of the Mujahideen. He can help you find Raul Menendez. We have fresh horses. You will follow. Oh shit. Let's do it. That's my horse. Mason, it's I said it too early. This is my horse. We're on our way to the Mujahideen camp now. 
sure I don't need to I remind know. you that our presence here must remain 100% deniable. Never there will be serious before. consequences if Russia learns of our involvement in Afghanistan. War dock. There are holes we in the mountains. We believe the Soviets are about to launch an attack on the camp. Major, kick it up with gear. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Woods. Show bastard. Tank out of the cave. This way. Can I maybe like sprint towards them? If a Russian attack is indeed imminent, you're gonna need all the help you can get. I've arranged for a couple of specialists to act in an advisory capacity. Here they are now. Hudson. Roman, this is Woods and Mason. My two best men. We need weapons, not soldiers. This should be good. Just so we're clear, we hold off the Russian attack, you give us what you have on Menendez. Our base is here. Any advance will come through one of the narrow passes leading into the valley. I know this. Our men defend these mountains. Our weapons will give them an edge. That's a bullshit plan. You're talking about the Russian army here. They come at you with brute force, which means strength in numbers and heavy armor. Are your men ready for that? They have no experience with the weaponry we brought. And we do. We belong on the front line. Gone. Yalla! Yalla! Borobirun! You have faith in your plans, America. We're more than faves out. Let's rock it. Oh, maybe there was something here, too. We must hurry! We cannot allow them to enter the valley! Sarah, <laughs> we're gonna lockpick their stuff. Their own stuff. So we're going to attack these guys first. Too fucking close! Follow me! Get up top. Wow. BTR's history. Fuck it, eh? Nice. Nice work, Mason. The Mujahid 
Dean can handle infantry. Mason, put a cranny charge under the archway. Let's make damn sure no more vehicles make it through here. Now we need to get back. Hope they uh, dipped some to the Russians. Oh yeah. Charge set. Come on, boots, just go faster. Blow it, Mason! Hudson, the west choke point is secure. Armor ain't getting through this way. Woods, Mason, they're throwing everything they have at us. We've got threats all over the valley. Hoosier reporting rushing tanks moving in from the north. Roots force the horse was walking the backwards. You expected such a fight. Go now. Come on, run. Jesus. Son of a bitch. Bet your ass he was. Kravchenko, 
Basically carved a hole in his head and he shoved those fucking numbers in there, and he survived that. No. <laughs> Mason said he didn't see those numbers anymore, but I don't know. I'm not so sure about that. Mason, better take a look. This isn't over yet. Russians want to give us one last display of brute force. Let's give them one last display of courage. You with me? Fucking hell, what is the thing? Times I saw the tick. They get that look in his eyes and scanning the room. <laughs> Next thing you know, he's talking to the Russian. Fucking Reznov. <laughs> Good old tricky Vic. Woods. Maybe I should handle this interrogation. If you see the fuck out of my way, I can unfinish business with this bastard. <laughs> I left you to rot in Vietnam, Sergeant Woods. You should be dead. Well, nobody told me. Buddy Raman tells me you're doing business with a Nicaraguan named Raul Menendez. What do you do for me? Oh, jeez. You believe in an eye for an eye? Huh? Why can I see through his scar? Jardine, baby. They'll bury you up to your neck, peel your eyelids back, and leave you to fry in the desert. I'll take you out quick. Oh no, the numbers. Tell me about Menendez. I suit him with That doesn't Must sound die. too Soviet of you, brother. The Soviet Union is dying. Money. The fuck are you doing? Menendez told me you must suffer. You face piece of shit. We have you fight the Russian on your side. No. No, you are and always will be our true enemy. <laughs> Without water and shelter, you may last a day. If you are strong... Oh, the days going by. Mm. 
So, in a desert buried, the year. Who does your father think rides up on a horse to save us? Tricky Vic. Yeah, see? You're just like your old man. No, it wasn't him. That's not him. Come on, if you think it was him, don't you think we would have stuck around for a bit, huh? Maybe explain some shit? Because Victor Rastoff isn't there anymore? Yeah, of course. Admiral on deck. Thank you, Commander Mason. Check out this beauty. Chairman Tian Zhao. Leader of China's military. The head of the SDC Coalition's armed forces. Cocksucker plays hardball, even with China's government. They have as much control over him as we do. This cat walks alone. Chairman Zhao's squeezing Russia's balls real tight. Commander. If Russia caves in and joins SDC, they'd be the largest military force on the planet. Which is precisely what Menendez wants. Setting up the superpowers to wipe each other out. Right now, Iran and India are both under threat. SDC's making their move. Time for JSOC to step up. Their initial strike caught us off guard and crippled our primary defenses. We held them off, but our regiment was decimated. We cannot withstand another attack. Was it SDC, Commander? We were hit by ground and air drones. FOB Spectre is vital to securing India's northern border. For rapid response, our only option is to halo in. The enemy's primary objective will be to smash the defense grid by targeting power generators and the satellite uplinks. If the grid goes down, there's nothing to stop them from penetrating the main control room. If that happens, FOB Spectre is down and it's open season on India. So we have to complete like a sort of tutorial. This is a really fun addition to the uh, story, Kim, actually, in uh, Black Ops. All units stand by. Okay, I want to run through a few systems checks and training maneuvers. Let's make sure we got this down. I want to do one thing, and then I'm going to skip it. I want a function check on Claw Opcon. Stand by. Claw can't feed online. This is completely for the story. All looks good. Let's run check on infantry camp feed. Infantry under direct command. Infantry HUD relay confirmed. Tasking infantry directly. Let me check turret camera functionality. Turret control confirmed. Weapon systems active. Checking AO sat feed. Switching to tactical map. Okay, a little bit of RTS in it as well. I want to make sure the claws waypoint pathing is good. Moving claw units to position. Set. Now I'm gonna skip it. That's what I like to see. Fucking textbook. Okay, th this was the last one for this recording.